Dogpack has replied about Mr. Beast and updated information. <clears throat> Man, I feel like I am one of those newscasters on TV that are just <clears throat> spewing out the YouTube news. So anyways, Dogpack, let's read it. <clears throat> it says here, double it and give it to the next disgruntled employee. This is a guy that exposed Mr. Beast, by the way, and that latest video got over 6.6 .6 million views or something like that. He says this. <clears throat> this came to him, I believe. Dear Mr. Dogpack, this firm, new firm whose white-collar criminal defense practices second to none, has recently been retained by Mr. Beast YouTube. LLC. My health is awful, people, so just bear with me. Mr. Beast or the company. And its founder, Jimmy Donaldson. Regarding the unsettling, unsettling news that you have embarked on a campaign to disparage or disparage. I haven't seen that word in a word. Disparage, it is. Mr. Beast as a company and defame Jimmy Donaldson as an individual. I think he did that himself, actually. Mr. Beast clearly was doing things he shouldn't be doing. We saw all the evidence. So don't try and act like this is pointing the finger to the person that is just accusing. There's no freaking way he's taken all the blame for it. He has no control over what Mr. Beast and his team does. But he does have control over what he sees and what he can report to the world. Anyways, let's continue. Not only are your statements about Mr. Beast and Jimmy Donaldson untrue. That's not true. We've seen the video evidence. You're basically telling the world that, that, that it's untrue then. Because we've seen it for our, with our own eyes. And there's a bunch of effery beeping going on. There's a lot of it. They they also violate the clear binding enforcement terms of your confidential and non-disclosure agreement with Mr. Beast. Well, he doesn't work for you anymore. So that's why he made the video. Yes, if he was working for you and he released a video, he's probably in deep doo-doo. But he doesn't work for you anymore. So he can say whatever the heck he likes. Freedom of speech. I was in the military. I fought for this country. And I fought for freedom of speech. So this guy can say whatever the f he wants. Dated 25th of March 2024. And he didn't release the video until after that. So he's fine. Which we have shown in videos posted to the internet. Yeah. The agreement when he's working there. Then prove it you have all the footage but instead of posting any you've just been deleting more. Yeah, so they've been deleting all the evidence, the people, of the Mr. Beast YouTube LLC, which is a corporation or company. So my opinion is, this is my message to Dogpack404 if you ever come across my video. Keep doing what you're doing. You have given us more than enough evidence. You've given us overwhelming evidence of what goes on at Mr. Beast on the videos and I would like to see what happens when it's off camera too. Oh my goodness. We saw some off camera, but we would like to see a lot more off camera. If we can get some hidden cameras of what really goes on there and what really they're talking about, then we can really see show Mr. Beast and his team how they really are, put them in their true light. Because they don't follow. They break a lot of rules. They break a lot of laws. They... D they don't follow nothing to do with religion in terms of anything good. Chandler does. He's the only decent Mr. Beast member they have, even though he was being corrupted at one point. And that's probably why he turned to the Bible, because he had no other choice. He was getting pissed off with the bad vibes and bad things around him. He was probably like, i got to get myself clean somehow. Like, this is ridiculous. I'm just infested with corruption due to massive profit gains. Is it worth it? I don't know. People do say when you become very wealthy and rich that you sell yourself to the devil. That might actually be true, you know? I feel like it's best if rich people just gave all their money away. They don't have to be as corrupted because everyone gets an equal share somehow, you know, from the mass dis un unequal, unbalanced distribution of wealth. Anyway, that's for another story, another video. If you guys are new, of literally to subscribe, you know what to do. <clears throat> I shouldn't have to say it. I am covering the story of Mr. Beast and his potential downfall one day. I mean, he has lost some subscribers, but he's gained more eventually. Um, you know, that is compensated with more. So it's like a losing battle. It's like taking on the Millennium Falcon. You know, you know, the, the, the dark side is bad. And, you know, the rebellions are actually not rebellions. They're the good people. 
but there being classes about people and you know it's you're up in a little x-wing you know with your shield getting blasted to pieces and you're trying to take out this uh huge fortress of a ship and it's just or a Death Star even, and it's just near impossible, but you know that there is some information you can push through to get intel so you can take something out from the inside. And Dog Pack is the answer. Dog Pack 404 YouTube channel with one video so far and a couple of community posts, or one community post, or a couple. Uh, he's really, you know, going above and beyond, putting his neck on the line, literally. This guy is a hero without a cape. And he's got 136,000 followers now, or subscribers, supporting him um, with one video, which is impressive. And, um, you know, he's got he's going to have a lot more people following him too. He doesn't even have this channel monetized. He's not even taking any money for everything he's doing because he just doesn't want the money. He just wants to see justice. And so does a lot of people, actually, you know, that are not corrupted by just dollar signs or pound signs or what currency you're in and whatever country you're in. Anyway, see you later, Bill. Bye.